Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel Hacker Factory. In this session, we are going to discuss and perform the username and email addresses enumeration. So to perform this enumeration, we should know about the tools and techniques. Before going to the tools and techniques, let's have one question. That's why we should need this information. Okay. So for example, when you have a task to perform red team assessment or a black box testing, you need this information because you have to perform phishing or spear phishing task on this target. So to perform this, we need these kind of information. Right. So let's start with the tools that we can use for the username, email and a phone number enumeration. So here on my screen, I have put some of the tools that we can use for the email addresses enumeration. Like we have a Maltego is there, right? People.com. This is a website which is now a paired website. So this now this one is also popular and it contains a lot of information of any person name, email addresses, phone number, address. So you can also see this. And we have a Spokio, this is also a website. You can also gather information from this website as well. Then we have already uh, the Harvester, which is the most popular tool to identify uh, the information related to the email addresses, Twitter handles, username like on LinkedIn, LinkedIn profiles, right? Subdomains information. And, uh, and the more easy way I think you guys know that just there are the social network profiles like we have a Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, LinkedIn. So this is the most easy way where you can just go to, to the profile, any of the any one of the profile and and you can see the information that what is the username, what is the email. So this is just a inf information gathering of the email addresses or a username. So uh, this way, uh, this way, what attacker can do, attacker can just uh, create a phishing, spear phishing, or sniffing the information through any, any, any of the target, right? So let's discuss first with the Maltego. So this one is the most popular tool for the enumeration, and uh, this is, uh, in, uh, you can uh, download it for both Linux as well as Windows. And here, this is the website from where you can download. You can just write here, Maltego download and hit enter. And here, go to the downloads. So if you don't have installed Java, then you can install with .exe plus Java. Uh, if you have a 32 bit, then x86. Or if you have a 64 bit system, then you can just download this one. Or if you have already a Java, then just click on this and install .exe. Okay, I have already installed the .exe file in my system, and on my desktop, you guys can see it's already there. In Maltego, you can just hit enter on this uh, Maltego tool, and it's just starting the modules first. Let's wait for a while okay it's starting uh, so before starting this uh, before this GUI uh, you have some of the uh, registration you can just register with any of the temporary email id and uh, this is just a free version this is also a paid tool and it's very costly so you for uh, in a free version you can find out much information that you need but for uh, for a black box or red team assessment, we have to purchase this tool to identify more information. Right. So let's see what kind of information we can gather through this tool. For example, there are some of the entities you can see here. You can create a new entities. Transforms are there, right? Transforms are basically these are the uh, these these are the kind of techniques which will help us to identify the information. So here you can see we can create a new new uh, task to identify information and here when you see the entities there are a lot of things like uh, we have devices information groups we can also identify information of a company organization 
when you just see an infrastructure there is information like uh, AES is there banners you can identify domains related information you can identify IP addresses information you can identify right mail exchange these are the records that I already discussed in my previous session so here a lot of things that you guys can do even you can identify the information to the locations like GPS coordinate circular areas you can just click on this and identify information malware uh, little information you can also identify here and this is a penetration related uh, penetration testing related information and here you can also see personal information like documents email addresses person related information phone number you can you can find out all that information but you have to purchase this tool first to identify this more information so let's take one of the example to identify information related to the email addresses for example there is a domain uh, you guys can just click on the domains or you can drag this domain into this graphical area and here you can see this one is the website uh, that is Petivera uh, this is the website for the Multego uh, who has de developed this tool right so here you guys can change your target and uh, for example I just uh, put here google.com and try to find out uh, the email addresses information of this and here you can just click on uh, you can just right click and you can see the transforms so these are some of the techniques through which you can identify information like you can find out the dns related information from the domain domain owner detail right email addresses from the domain historical snapshots you can get the files and documents from the domains so this information is much for any of the any of the attacker uh, to gather the information uh, let's we, uh, we have a target to identify the email address so, so you can just click on this one and see what information you will find here I started and here oh wow you guys can see here that how is it will identify information and just zoom it zoom it zoom it and here you can also link but i will don't go for here so here you guys can see the email addresses some of the email addresses we have found but not much but this is the technique that through which we can identify the information right and you guys can also do one thing or if you want all the information you can just click on this and and perform all transform so it will what it will do it will start you can just start and see what it will identify wow so these are the subdomains oh my god i think this is enough for anyone to gather information for any anything that you want or you want so there is a lot of information just searching it's 91 percent here and you guys can see there is a lot of things sorry and here you can also see the name servers oh you guys can also see the phone number details so these are the phone numbers you can also see contact numbers and the country location as well you can also see here okay and the names username the person name you can also see here right so i think this is the best tool to identify the information but if you have a paid version then definitely you will get more information but don't do it for a legal part right so use this as for the learning purposes okay but don't go for illegal purpose right so there are more options to identify the information like we have again gps coordinates are there you you have to just what you have to do you just go for example i have to delete it first and 
so yeah i have deleted all them select control a and then delete all the entities and you can you can just uh, drag and drop any of the entities if you want like person letter tell you just enter here and here you guys can see like the zone name the name of the person is zone you can edit any name here like uh, uh, like i write here jack right so you can just uh, write the name of any person and then click the right button and again you can find out the email addresses from this person entity any entity or run all the transforms so you have to fill some of the information and let's see so you have to specify some of the domains information like uh, you can write here google or bing or anything and then it will identify the information from the search engines as well so let's see so here some of the email addresses which belongs to sorry which uh sorry which belongs to the name jack so i think this is the way and uh, this is uh, much information for you guys to identify with multigo right or anything you want and you just drag and drop and put uh, the details in the circle box and definitely you will identify the information that you want all right so this is what the multigo is and the next we'll go for the next tool that is the people.com and spoke these are the website you guys can just browse it in your url like people.com and here this is the website but first of all you have to create a login now but this is a paid website so you guys can just register this with a official email id and you can use only for 72 hours and you can find out the information that what you want right again we have this pokio here uh, Spock is there right this is also people search engine so here you can see the name email phone number address is related detail you can just write here any name like jack i i can write jack jack smith right and search for this name see what are the result that i will get again searching searching full address location history phone number right so this this kind of information you guys can find out through this pocket.com as well so here you guys can see the result that there are a lot of results related to that name and uh, you can also find out the addresses it include eight addresses three phone number three email addresses and also the location where he live <clears throat> right so this way you guys can identify more more information you can just write a phone number here email addresses and thing that you have right and you guys can identify the information next we have already uh, the harvester we have right so i already told you my first or second session about the harvester you guys just write a command that again i'll let you know that what is the command okay so i have already i have already done a uh, one of the one of the uh, email uh, email enumeration for yahoo.com so this was the command you guys can see the harvest hyphen b yahoo.com hyphen v google google uh, is the search engine from uh, basically hyphen b is the source and uh, it will it will uh, take all the result from the search engines like if you write here all then definitely it will identify information from a lot of domains that the harvester contain like uh, you can just see here in the help sorry it's depreciated so it's a capital h and hit enter so in the source list you guys can see there are a lot of things right bing is there duckduckgo is there right google yahoo twitter linkedin 
a lot of fish you guys can find out through the harvester so that time you guys can see i have just run the command and here i have found some of the email addresses information like uh here you can see arpita722 right at the yahoo.com there are a lot of email addresses that uh, that are harvested identified and these are some of the some of the subdomains that i already told you in the second session right again uh, we have some of the uh, social network profiles like on linkedin facebook twitter you can also gather information from these profile as well that what is the name what is the username email addresses phone number and uh, this is also part of information gathering which will help us uh, in the red team assessment task right and uh, we have also a one more website which is helpful for us to identify information that is people.com uh, sorry uh, that one is the email hunter <clears throat> you can just write here email hunter and uh, click on this hunter.io uh, for, for for more information you have to just uh, sign up this website and you know there is many things which is paid you right so you have to pay some amount and definitely you will get more information but this one is also enough information you just write here any of the target like yahoo.com you can write here yahoo.com right okay no result related to yahoo.com okay no problem you can write any other domain okay so it has google related email addresses if i just click on this okay so here uh, there are a lot of results that it have found so for these uh, yeah, to view these email addresses you have to just sign up into the application again we have msn.com just see no there is no result but msn.com.te has three result okay so these are the results <coughs> it depends what you search and how you search right so you have to advance your search techniques to identify these kind of information for your red team assessment task right so there are a lot of ways there are a lot of tools which will help us to identify this information right <clears throat> and if you want the linkedin or the twitter profile information then you can find out through the harvester there is i already told you about the harvester that one is the tool the harvester and uh you can also use this tool recon ng right so this one is also important tool so for this uh, you have to uh, use some of the apis to find out more information so this is also in the kali linux you can use this tool for uh, the email addresses or any any information gathering techniques you can identify the information through recon ng so thank you guys i hope you like my session and please subscribe share and hit the bell icon